What is going on guys? The iTunes fanboy here today. Guys, I'm going to show you guys how you can downgrade your iPhone 5, 5C, or iPad 4 to a 6 or 7. This is tethered, which means you have to go into the tool and boot back up every time. And this does require a MacBook. Here are the download things. So this is github.com, which is where you go ahead and get your tool nightshade. There's also a jailbreak tool. You're going to need to also go to ipsw.me. If you have an iPhone 5 or 5C, click on iPhone. If you have an iPad 4, click on iPad. Let's just say I'm down, downloading my, downgrading an iPhone 5. So I'm going to go into here. And you're going to need to go all the way down to iOS 7 IPSWs or iOS 6 IPSWs. So on 5C you can only do 7 as it didn't get 6. Those are download links. I may leave links to the descriptions below. So now what you're going to need to do is open up your downgrade tool. You'll probably need to left click it. So what you're going to need to do is hit re restore IPSW. Now you're going to need to press re select IPSW. This will drag you into the little finder area. Drag over your IPSW or just find it. I'm just dragging you over my IPSW and you're going to need to hit open and press restore. Waiting for, it'll say waiting for device in DFU mode. So now I'll show you. Now I'm going to show you guys how to enter DFU mode. So first off you'll need to power off your device. Wait for it to shut down. Now, after that, you're going to need to hold down the power button for three seconds and outline go of the power button, hold down the power and home button for 10 seconds, and then wait and, and then hold the home button until the tool recognizes it. For me, it takes about, I've done this on iPhone 5C and iPhone 5 before. It usually takes me about 11 to 12 seconds, but let's hit it. One, two, Three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So it's in. It's already doing that great. You'll need to re enter DFE mode, which is just holding down power and power button for three seconds, holding down the home button and power button for 10 seconds, and holding the home button for until it recognizes it. This is what a Tever downgrade looks like, BTW. You should still see nothing on the screen. Now you will. I don't know if I'm showing this very clearly. This is the same iPad 2 that iPad 4 that was in my Apple collection video BTW. Yay yay yay. And BTW we're all and BTW can sort of see how I make my videos. Done! Great! I'm going to leave it connected just in case. Now, to... now here is the lovely guest of honor itself, the iPad. Okay.
As you can see here, here we get the lovely setup screen here, classic iOS 6. I'm gonna enter my Wi Fi. If you have an Apple ID on the iPad BTW, we'll ask you uh, to enter it. You Siri, don't send. Start using. Great, we get the whole classic iOS 6. And as you can tell, you're jumping into settings. Let me just make sure it doesn't show the serial number. Six point oh, we achieved six point oh. I don't know if software updates work or not. No, they don't work on the five C, but I'm not sure about the four. But if you, yes, I can update to eight point four point one if I want to. I can tell we get the lovely iOS 6. So f fast. What's the weather today? Here's what I found. No, I don't live in New York City. I'm just stating that but yeah so this is the end of the video please like and subscribe for more content like this in total this took this video is about 21 minutes long so this process should take you about 15 minutes i don't know you'll have to test it for yourselves but i am not responsible for broken devices btw so do not blame me although you can't comment anyway but do not blame me. Please like and subscribe to help the channel. I'm at 44 subscribers, so close to 50. And thank you all for supporting and watching this video. Bye-bye.